Hey guys and welcome back to another video on my channel. We're back in the 1.16 survival realm and today we have done some um, upgrades to the shopping area. Last episode we built the um, ore store which is right there and off camera I removed our shop that was here um, due to we literally did not we weren't selling nothing in it so it was a waste of time it being there so I moved our rocket shop from here to here uh, just so we can have a clear path here and then off camera I flattened a lot of area over here and as you can see people have started to build um, some shops so I flattened um, the area this shop uh, which is our barter shop was here I moved it to uh, our next to our ore store and a creeper did blow up I need to get some bone blocks and um, then this shop has popped up which is um, they sell sand is it only sand um, yes, it looks like it. Okay, so I sell sand and then uh, This shop has popped up which they I'm guessing they sell gravel um, Yes, they sell gravel, okay, and then this shop has also popped up which they sell cobblestone um, Yeah, cobblestone so three new shops have popped up uh, off camera and It's uh, the shopping area is coming together the reason I f uh, flattened this big area is because people were building shops on top of each other um, like these two where it's hard to now get a path from here to that shop although it can be done through the middle um, I wanted the shopping area to be spread out a bit more so there's like room there the shopping area can be dug that way more it can also go that way more um, it, it has to stop around here because of obviously bases here and there but yeah, it can still go in these directions and today I want to actually stock uh, some more stuff into this and um, I should really put um, an iron block in there um, So let's go get an end chest because I want to stock coal and redstone I think Right, so guys, I am now heading over. I've got uh, all our spare ores and we have a few stacks of redstone and not much coal um, okay, so let's put redstone in this one. We're gonna do it the same as the iron one diamond for 16 Which is just over uh, two stacks and then um, I'm just gonna do the coal in this one which is uh, One diamond for 16 as well um, Yeah, I will grind some more of this off camera. I might be able to find some more and stuff like that, but Yeah, the shopping area is now there's a lot appearing but I actually want to now get some uh, what's it called and I want to get some diamonds because I actually want to buy some sand so let's get valuables do I have an empty shulker box I do right so let's head over yeah because I want to buy some sand from in here and uh, because no one's actually selling concrete yet so how much is it it's one diamond one stack for one diamond okay so let's take um Right, let's take nine stacks. Uh, so that line was full. So let's, that's uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, seven, eight, nine. So that's nine stacks. Then let's take that stack, which is 10 stacks. Um, okay, so I think 10 stacks is enough for now. So let's now put them diamonds back, take that and take that. And yeah, so we've now got, uh, we have unlimited gravel, so we don't need to buy gravel, but we can now get some concrete. But now what I want to do is I actually want to head back to the nether because I want to get a OP pigman or pigling. Right, so guys, I'm in a creative uh, test world and what I mean by an OP pigling is piglins can actually pick up uh, armor. It don't matter what armor, they can even pick up elytras. Um, so... This pigling now has elytra on and yeah so piglings they can even pick up uh, playheads if I kill him and put another pigling down and get a, um, a skull dragon head let's say and put give him a dragon head he should as you can see pick that up they are like zombies and they can pick up any armor in the uh, game so um, a wither skull they should almost also pick up and as you can see 
Now you can pick up literally anything. So I think we are going to uh, get a pigling that has um, pretty much anything on them. So we can choose what they have. Right, so guys, we're back in the realm. And yeah, so pretty much we can choose what they have on their heads. And I think we are going to give them a dragon head. Um, as well as um, probably diamond armor. So if we head down here and go into our spare armor shulker box, which should be here somewhere, spare armor. And then uh, we can give him elytra. Um, and we can also, I didn't know I had a chest piece there. If I take that actually, that will do an achievement. Um, we should get an achievement for that. Maybe that was the achievement. Okay, right. So yeah, pretty much if we take the elytra, um, leggings and boots, and then um, a helmet, which we want, um, we want a dragon he head if we can. Uh, do we have any in here? No. Uh, do we have any in our player skulls? Where are they? Um, jog head. There it is. Uh, we have one dragon head, which is good. Okay, so we can give them that. Um, now let's put that back. Right, so let's now go and find a pigling. We also do need to name the pigling, um, which we need a name tag for. And I don't think I have any name tags. I'm going to quickly go check to see if someone, um, if anyone's selling emeralds, and then I'll be right back. Right, so guys, it is a brand new day for me, um, in real life. Um, and we're going to scrap the idea of building a, um, melon and pumpkin farm, because I actually need to finish digging the hole, um, underneath our base in the overworld. Um, before we build the farms, and I actually forgot about that. So what we're gonna do is actually build this guy a house. So we're gonna. The ha I was gonna do it redstone, but then I thought no, there's no point. So we're now gonna do it out of. Um, is it gonna be the doors? I'm pretty sure picklings can open doors though, so these have to, my, might have to be replaced with uh, metal doors. I don't know if they can open uh, doors or not. I'm pretty sure they can though. So we're gonna have this go out. Um, to uh, back here. So let's. I need to dig away some of this land. Um, uh, I thought we got out then. It won't. It was just him through the block. Right. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Right. So guys, I have now finished building the floor. Of the uh, house for Pigman. I've moved him. He did actually kill me. Um, if I go back here. Uh, I was actually slain by him. Um, so I just threw him down this hole. Until. Oh there's another one down there with him. Um, yeah I just threw him down there. Until we have finished the house. Because um, that room that I had him in. Is getting in the way. And so are hoglings. But what, we want, what I want to do now. Is build this wall up. And how it's going to be, oh my god, who's this now? Go away. Um, die. There we go, perfect. So, what we need to do is we need to start, like, mining some of this away. Um, so we can actually get to the thingy. And then in these corners, there's going to be, um, these blocks. I forgot what they're called. Um, uh, they are called chiseled polished blackstone. And they're going to go in the corners like so. Um, oh my god, there's so many picklings. Go away. And then what we're going to do is we're going to have some... Uh, oh my god. I think one of these are going to kill me in a minute. Um, he shouldn't attack me. No, he isn't. Okay, right. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, and four. And there's another one. Did I just see one? No. Okay, right. And then what we're going to do is we're going to have glass. Um, if I can actually get the glass glass along here like that um with then um we need to move him a little bit more with then i think um go away pesky piglings you just got wrecked so glass is going to be on this wall and that wall 
Uh, you need to die as well, and so do you. Um, yes, perfect. Right, so, finally, let's now kill him. Right, so there's going to be glass on that wall, and also this wall. Uh, let's quickly remove this tree, or this fungi, whatever you want to call it. Um, it's so annoying that these uh, leaves don't decay, or these uh, warp blocks don't decay. That is one annoying thing about these trees. Right, so guys, we are now on our way to the shopping district because we actually need uh, some nether wart, and I'm pretty sure someone sells it there. I'm not 100% sure, but we need some uh, red nether bricks um, for the roof of the house, or the roof of the piglings, pigman, pigling, whatever you want to call it, its house. Um, I'm pretty sure someone sells nether wart. Uh, I'm not too sure though. Let's just hope. If someone does sell it, they have it in stock. Right, so guys. Um, I'm pretty sure this shop sells it. Um, yes, one diamond for 32. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine diamonds. Uh, so one block. Perfect. And let's now do that. Uh, I'm going to turn it into them just so it's not confusing for whoever's shop it is. Um, what else do they sell in here? Do that they sell bottles? Is that it? I know there's like more down here, but I don't know if they've stocked anything down here yet. Um Nope. It, they haven't. Okay. Right, so I'm pretty sure this is Crabbo's uh base, but I'm not too sure. Uh not base uh shop. And I also bought some glass from here earlier. And there's also a um pacified um Pillager, uh, with his crossbow removed, which I'm pretty sure is a bug. I don't know if, it, if it's intended, if they're going to keep it in the game. But you basically just have them, uh, pillagers shoot at a, a mob they attack, so Iron Golem, uh, Villager, or something like that. And eventually their crossbow breaks because it has durability, unlike, um, oh my god, there's loads of hoglings. Unlike most other uh, mobs, like zombies, uh, pigmen. And all that. So let's quickly take him out. And let's now go down here. Because I actually need to get some um, nether bricks. Do I have a crafting table down here? No I don't. But I do have that. Right. So it's these I need I'm pretty sure. Let's just grab a few stack of them. Um, let's throw that away. And get another stack. Um, red nether brick. Um, there it is. Perfect, and we can get two stacks, and if I just make these into uh, actual slabs, that's probably the best way to do it. Um, I have literally, I barely ever make red nether bricks. Um, is there any like red, is there no like chiseled or cracked variant variants of the red nether brick? Or is it literally only red nether brick? Um, where are all these mobs coming from? Oh my god, go away, um, Andrew. And you, and you. Perfect. Right. Let's now go and do the roof. Um, the roof is going to be on that layer there. I'm pretty sure. Or one layer above that, maybe. Let's go one layer above that. Right. So, let's now build up with glass. And it's going to go here. Like so. I need to break that block. I might like staircase it up a bit. So let's quickly just get that and break these blocks. Right, so guys, the rough room is now laid out. Behind these windows are going to be lava. Uh, same on that side. And I was just thinking, um, due to the uh, adult piglings being um, like hostile towards players, we could give a baby pigling the items and have the pigling as a baby because then the babies won't attack us and also it, babies won't grow up into adult piglings no matter what um, unless obviously use commands so we could use a baby pigling uh, to do this which will be easier because it won't, we won't then get attacked by the pigling so, 
Let's try that. Um, but I will have to kill him first. Um, yeah, I will have to kill him. Let me just make sure baby piglins can pick up items. Because I'm not sure if they can or not. Um, it looks like a hunt's going on out there. Let's quickly just kill all these. And then we also need to light up in here. Um, so let's do that. And then that. that or let's just spam torches. They don't need to be even. We'll give it a proper light source soon. Right, so guys, I'm in the creative test world. And baby piglings can pick up items. Um, as you can see, he has picked up the dragon head, the elytra. And it's resized to his model, which is a good thing. Um, but they can open doors as he literally just opened that door and ran. So, that is a good thing to know. So, we can now hop back on the realm and give a baby pigling the items. Right, so guys, I have now put some gold blocks in the corner and also a gold block head. Um, I would need to get some more of these uh, from Wandering Traders. I also want uh, gold ore. Um, never gold ore, and also if we can get gilded blackstone. I also want some of that. I've also put some item frames with gold and pork chops. I also put some hoggling heads, and I've put another pile of gold. Um, I've now done the lava and put gold blocks underneath them. Um, I also lost two of the uh, glass in the lava, so I need to replace them too. And that's it. I might put a bed or something here for the pigling. Um, there's still some more I need to do in here to make it feel a bit more f like home for the pigling. But this is now Pigman's house. So let's head out of here. These are iron doors now so they can't get uh, out of here. Um, because they can actually open any type of wooden door. So that's that. Um, now yeah, off camera I will just make that look a little bit better. I also now need to replace these uh, uh, back with... Um, what is it called? Neverack. So that's like that. And that's done now, I think. Um, yeah, apart from that I need to do a bit more in here. That's done. So let's quickly head to the shopping area. Right, so guys, I'm in the shopping area. Um, I wanted to come here. I don't know what this is. I don't know why this is here. Um, I don't know if it's meant to be a start of a shop or something. But I'm not too sure. But, oh, it looks like there's maybe something on the top shelf, uh, top floor now. I may be wrong. Um, what's this? One diamond per book. Fawns three. Okay, that I don't have fawns on none of my armor, I don't think. I think next episode we're going to work on getting this a bit more OP. Um, because I upgraded my tools off camera. We now have efficiency 5, mending and unbreaking on all of them. And then if I want a fortune or silk touch, then it's on them. Like my axe, I don't have fortune or silk touch. Um, because at the moment I don't need either of them. But, yeah, so that is probably going to be the end of this episode. Next episode, that rocket shop will probably be gone. As um, Dejorium and I are, or Dejorium is redesigning it, and we're gonna um, share a shop 50/50 uh, profits and um, anything. I did stock it uh, off camera, and um, that was a grind to stock, but I managed to do it. Um, so yeah, next episode that sh may be gone. It depends. Um, it may still be there. It depends on when I record, but. If you did enjoy, leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in another video very soon. Bye!